Hi, we're John and Leah. And today we are exploring Nashville on a hop on, hop off trolley tour. It looks so cool. It's the Old Town Trolley and it, I think there's 14 different stops and it takes you all throughout Nashville. We've really only kind of explored Broadway, so we're really excited to go to Music Row and just see all the sights that there are in Nashville. Thank, thank you. you. Hi there, how are you? Oh, good, thank you. How are you? You're great, thank you. Oh, this is nice. Thank Hi. you. Oh. Thank you very much. Um, should we go to the back? Yeah, back in the middle of the windows. Yeah, yeah windows, yeah. Oh, good shout. Lovely. We love a bus tour. We have done one since excited. LA. Yeah. We last did an LA TMZ bus tour, but oh now I'm getting gosh. all the flashbacks. I just remember sitting at the, the front of the bus in LA and I was just creasing because it was a whole thing was a celebrity spotty tour. We didn't but we didn't see, see any clip. celebs. <laughs> so we were like, where are the celebs? Yeah. Um, but yeah. This is great. It's really so, good how fun. much more are we looking at? So, for two adults, Today we have paid $94, okay. just under $94. Like pounds um, maybe? Yeah, and I think considering we can use it all day, it's cheaper than Ubering around and you get the guided audio. I, I think there's all, they must have a microphone. I think so, so. Yeah. yeah. They said it was um, something like, oh I can't remember, there was something like edutainment oh. or something like that. Oh, I'm here, I'm here for the lols. Yeah. So the hop on hop off trolley tour starts here on Broadway, just across from the Cumberland River. Nearby there you've got the Hard Rock Cafe and you also get to see the Johnny Cash Museum and the Patsy Cline Museum as well nearby. Then it moves over to the Country Music Hall of Fame and Music City Centre. There were lots of extra decorations up because at the time the CMAs were on at the Bridgestone Arena. If you don't know what the CMAs are it stands for the Country Music Awards and it was so cool to be in Nashville at the same time as the CMAs. This part of the tour was the Tennessee State Capitol and we ended up learning a lot about how Nashville ended up getting the State Capitol there and a lot about past conflict between other contenders in Tennessee like Knoxville and it was very very interesting because Nashville basically gave land to the government and said like here's all this land for free build the state capital here so they kind of like self-inflicted it upon themselves it was very interesting and very sneaky look over here to your left you're gonna see a big black globe right there folks yeah. That black globe is nine tons of granite floating on an eighth of an inch of water. It is so well balanced that if you walk up and put your hand on it, you can stop nine tons from moving. Oh, wow. And you can change directions of it. It's made to be so balanced that even a child could do that. We rode past the farmer's market, which apparently had some fantastic Tennessee whiskey. Looking back, we wish we'd stopped here and explored the market stalls for an hour or so. But we had a lot to do that day, so we kept on going on the bus. Lots of people did actually get off here and get a bite to eat and drink, so if we ever go back to Nashville, we'll definitely do that. We have learned so much, especially about whiskey. But we're actually not going to pass fitting, but it is just about a mile that way. Miss University. higher learning institutions here. About to pass so, Parthenon. when and Wood and Plaster Parthenon finally fell down a little bit, ah, oh my God. we decided to build one out of stone and steel, which you can see right over here, guys, so that we would always have yeah. one with us. Uh, it is only one eighth of an inch impressive. off of being a perfect replica of the original Parthenon yeah. that stood in Athens, Greece. Oh my gosh, Anybody it's like, off, it's insane. Through. Obviously in Greece it doesn't go anything Thanks, like guys. that. We'll see you later, they enjoy just yourselves. One brand new like, like for like. It's mad, isn't it? It is mad, it's, it's mad. like, it's a box of There's always something structure, going on. But then when you think that it's like, like built modern, oh, so you're like, well of course it's still standing. Of course it is. But now I know why they're called Athens of the South, is because Nashville was the first place to get a school. Right guys, we've just popped off the hop on, hop off. Bye. Bye. We're near Music Row, but we don't know exactly where. We've basically been now deserted yes. in the middle of nowhere. We also are near a Hattie Bee's and everyone's yeah. been banging on about the hot chicken. Yeah. And whilst we were on the bus, he was talking about how all the different flip, like levels are hot. Yes. Which reminded me of Nando's, but then it took it one step further because he was like, there's also a hot, 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 hot that um, you have to sign a waiver for it. Yeah. 
in it's case called shut the clock up. Shut the clock up. But yeah. what's it in case of? In case you go into anaphylactic shock. Anaphylactic shock or something like that. Yeah. I thought it was like anahilation, anahilat. Anyway, a shock. A shock. From eating too much spice. So we're not having that. No, I'm gonna go for like the mild one. Okay. Basically like chicken for children. Yeah. She'll have a kids menu and I'll try a medium. Yeah. But we'll see. Guys, we've arrived at Panera Bread. It would not be a job on the trip. No. Uh, <laughs> England. <laughs> it wouldn't be a Joe and Leah trip if we didn't go to Panera Bread. So it had to be done. How is it then? Next tea of the day. Next tea of the day. I did say I wouldn't have caffeine today, but here we are. Yeah, they had almond milk, so I'm pleased with that. Fab. Um, the tea bag looked good. Yeah, we're in a different area. It's fun. Like, just enjoy it. And what did you get, Jolie? Oh, I just got a Diet so Pepsi and a, and a cookie. Oh, a DP? A DP. They didn't have DC, so I had to get DP. Oh, okay. And I got something called a kitchen sink cookie, which is so heavy and delicious. And I definitely don't need it, but I want it because this That's is Taylor Swift's fine. local Panera bread. So, yeah. gotta celebrate. Absolutely. Do they warm up for you? No, sadly not. You Never mind. Go and tell. My brother wants it warmed up. Yes, please. No. I actually would. You today. would. That's, so I won't encourage her. No, my son really wants it warmed up. My son. And just see if they back my idea. Yeah. Yours. Yeah, my son. His name's my son. <laughs> Guys, we've made our way to what we believe is Taylor Swift's apartment. Oh, it's a bit windy. Um, oh, yeah. We're but at, yeah. at Taylor Swift's apartment just off Music Road. Fantastic. So big moment for Joel. This is amazing. Oh, yeah. They need a plaque that says, like, Taylor, Taylor Swift lives here. here. When she's in Nashville. And they should have a flag, like the Queen does, where if the flag's up, it means that Taylor's are there. And if it's the flag's not there, then it means that the Queen's not there. Flash this Queen. Taylor. Queen Taylor. Yeah. But look out for Taylor in every truck <gasps> you see. Is that Taylor Swift? Probably. Who knows? Who knows? Right, we're going to hop back on the hop on hop off Far. trolley tour yeah. and resume the tour. I think we're yeah. about just over halfway through. Yeah. There's lots of like cool little graffiti and artwork around here. I don't really know what's so good about Music Row other than like no. obviously got all the studios. We walk past a ton of record label places, mm. Sony and mm -hmm. loads of others. So I'm not really sure what else is here. Yeah. Um, it's other not as vibey, Taylor's is it? Home. There's not as other much than vibe. Taylor. Yeah, it's definitely a different scene. We went into a CVS and everyone was wearing masks, and we were like, okay, that's not what's been happening in downtown Nashville. So yeah, in downtown, um, you yeah, like they look at you funny. Yeah, you I was like, one. why are you got that on? Yeah. Whereas here, it's the opposite way around in yeah. Midtown. So you kind of just blend with the area and go with what people are doing to be respectful to their like yeah. district. Well, that exactly. These bars are cool. There's one called Winners, and there's one over here called, called Losers. Losers, and they look really honky tonky. I think there'd be a right old honky tonk down here. And yeah. Maybe that's what Music Row. That maybe this is where Taylor Swift got her first big break. No, she got it at, at Bluebird Blue Cafe. We need to find that actually. We need to find Bluebird. Is it down these ends? Maybe. Maybe Let she me bought Google a flat it. Near, near Bluebird to be like. Yeah. Throwback. I'm still Jenny from the block. It's like us buying a house near Rada. That's where we started. Yeah. Last. Except that. All the houses would so cost like imagine. six million. <laughs> yeah, bankrupt ourselves. Dogwood. Dogwood. That looks nice. 